Hey guys and welcome to my kitchen, I'm Julia. Today I'm going to show you guys how to make a delicious orange cake with some dark chocolate chips in, so let's get started. My oven is already at 150 degrees C convection oven. If you don't have convection, how about 170 degrees C? First up, I'm just going to whisk my eggs together with my sugar. I'm just in with some flour to my bowl here and some baking powder. Let's give that a quick mix. Like that. And then I'm just going to add in some milk and some of the butter. So I'm just going to add in some orange juice and then the zest from run orange. Just give it all a good mix. And then in with my eggs and sugar. And then last but least, in with some dark chocolate chips. Four quality chocolate just to make this cake here even more delicious. And the chocolate chips here is optional if you don't want chocolate chips in there. I'm just using a bread tin today to bake my cake in, but you can just bake it in whatever tin you want to. Just make sure that there is enough room for about 1,500 milliliters in there or more. So just in with my batter here. And my foam here is very big, so my cake here might bake less than it will in your tin if you are using a smaller tin than I'm using here. My tin is 2.3 liters big, so that's 2,300 milliliter. So that's 800 milliliter more. That was just some quick math. <laughs> but now my cake here is basically baked in the oven until a toothpick comes out clean. My cake is now out of the oven, it smells amazing. It got exactly 40 minutes in my oven, but just keep an eye on your cake. And yeah, now I'm just going to cool down. And when it is cooled down completely, I'm just going to make a quick, delicious icing for the top using some water, some cocoa powder on Sweden, and then some icing sugar, just mixing it well around. You don't really need any ingredients list for this here because you decide how thick you want your glaze to be or icing and then how much of a cocoa flavor you want in there so you just add and taste, add and taste until it is perfect for your taste and then it's just going to be poured all over the cake and then it's going to sprinkle over some orange All right guys, so I'm ready to give my orange cake here a go. Mmm, that is so moist. Wow, oh. mmm, <laughs> yum yum. Really nice, um, zesty flavor. It is not too overpowering with the orange. But you can really taste that it's in there. It is delicious and I really love the dark chocolate. But the dark chocolate also 
removes a bit of that orange flavor. So if you want a strong orange flavor, I would definitely not add in the dark chocolate chips, but I absolutely love chocolate and cakes. So that's why I always add that in. It feels delicious. I really love this orange cake here. I've made it so many times. Mm. But just remember, the chocolate is optional. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel here. And if you want to give this cake here a go, all the videos are down below. Yeah, check in again tomorrow for my next recipe. Bye.